All right, today we're going to talk about metric prefixes. Again, really short because we're just going over the worksheet. Right. 395 centimeters to meters. So you should recognize that there are 100 centimeters in a meter. So that means uh, if there are 100 centimeters in a meter, there are going to be 3.95 meters. Okay, we're converting liters to milliliters. There are 1,000 milliliters in a liter. So I have to multiply this by 1,000. So there are 2,650 milliliters in 2.65 liters. 9.44 kilometers, I'm going to meters. There are 1,000 meters in a kilometer. So again, I multiply by 1,000. Uh, how many centigrams are, I'm converting from centigrams to grams. Now remember, centi means hundredth. Right, just like there's centimeters in a meter. So if you think about this for just a second, you'd say, well, there are 100 centimeters in a meter. So that means there are 100 centigrams in a gram. So this would mean that I have to divide by 100. So there would be 5.843. That is how many grams that is. Again, think of it with meters if that helps you. Uh, because then you should be able to do the math. All right, I'm converting from millimeters to meters. There are a thousand millimeters in a meter. So this was kind of one of those where I was kind of trying to trick you because you might say, well, I have to multiply by a thousand. No, you don't. You have to divide by a thousand. So this number becomes 0 .000. 000. Two, three, four, three. All right, I'm converting millimeters into meters. So if there were 100 millimeters, that's only uh, 0.1 meters. Okay? All right, let's do these. Meters to centimeters. All right, well, that means there are 100 centimeters in a meter, so I have to multiply by 100. So that's 2945.3 centimeters. Right. I now have to go from meters to kilometers. Well, there are a thousand meters in one kilometer. So that means I have to move my decimal point three positions. So there are going to be 182.934 kilometers. I'm converting milliliters. That's a small amount to liters, which is a big amount. There are a thousand milliliters in a liter. So if I'm converting to liters, I have to move my decimal point three positions. So that becomes 0 to 8 liters. How about converting liters to centiliters? Remember, there are 100. Centi means 1. There are 100 centiliters in a liter. So this is going to be 56. And I have to make multiply by 100. So there is my 100. So it's 5,600. That's not a decimal point. That's a comma. All right. And 64 centimeters to millimeters. You should know that there are 10 millimeters in a centimeter. So since I'm since I have 64 centimeters, that's going to give me 640 millimeters. And that's it. I'll see you in class. Have a good one.